Hello everyone, this is Robert here, bringing you more eye. Well, what can I say? There's interesting people. Let's take a look at what this game's about and have fun. Okay, this is obviously a first-person Elder Scrolls game from Arena. Oh, what do we have here? It looks like a lovely day outside. You should head out to the farm to get to the farm if you get the chance. Spend some time with the animals. Oh, okay. Okay, sure. Um. Oh, I I can't check your you know your wallpaper bookshelf. No wallpaper bookshelf. Oh, wait. No. Okay. Screw you, man. Ah, it's, it's impolite. I just wanted to raid your stuff, but whatever. I heard there's a gold. I heard there's gold in the cave, but I'm too scared to enter. They say there's a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Well, can I sleep in your wall bed? Can't. No, I can only. Oh wait. No. Well, at least I. At least oh. At least I turned to talk to him. Oh come on! Look, just just leave the cabin. There we go. Why hello there, preacher. My prayers go out to poor Julia. It's been a year since her husband has passed. She hasn't been she has been seen all day. I imagine she is grieving. Do you mind visiting her at her home? It's the house to the right as you leave town. Sure. What about you? you? Need to stay close to Mama, otherwise she'll worry that we've run off. Why, hello, Mother. Do you have a name? Did you hear about the boy? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you hear about the boy? Julia lost her son in the cave shortly after her husband died. Poor Julia. I would never let my boys run out of my sight. Oh, that's sad. What about you, little girl? Sometimes Daddy lets us pat the sheep on the head. They're so soft. I'll be right back. Go. And we're back. Hi. Okay, she pat sheep. My un my uncle and dad are out chopping wood to keep us warm in the winter. They should be home soon. Oh, that's nice. Okay, well, nothing here. Wow! This is a big village. One, two, three, four! Ah, ah, ah. Got it. Four! Ah, ah, ah. Houses. Okay, well, no one's in here. Oh, there's wall beds. Do I get to claim the wall beds? Please. Look at the bookshelf. There's a picture on the shelf of a wife, husband, and young boy. I wonder where they are. That's a good question. Stop. Leave cabin. Look at bookshelf. Oh, look at bookshelf. I thought there was something else. No. No, there's only bookshelves. Well, I guess we're going that way. Read signpost. To the farm. Okay, fair enough. Ah, uh, this brings me back to days like Catacomb and Hex. Ah, uh, they were so evil. Oh, there's a sheep. Bah. Bah. Okay, what about you? Boy, you. S someone's got. There has to be something here. I can't be wasting my time. Is it just me or is this whatever? This sounds like someone just going bah, bah, and just alternating their voice. Ooh, that one does not sound too good. I'm wasting my time, aren't I? Oh, poke sheep. I'm not petting sheep, I'm poking sheep. Oh, uh, sure. There we go. Sometimes. Oh, the door is locked. It's hard because even if you like poke them. You get stuck and you think you just haven't exited the chat. So, wow. There goes that. Ah, uh, this takes me back. All right, hello there, far Lumberjack. My brother and I were chopping wood when we heard mo moans coming from the cave. My brother went in to investigate. He should have been back by now. I'm worried. Can you go check on, can you check on him? There's a lantern behind you on that stump. Oh, thank you. Pick up lantern. I picked up the lantern. I have equip. Pardon me. I have equipment. Let's go to cave. Hey, you. Come over here. Come over here. They're they're twins, so they sound exactly the same. Did my brother send you? Bless him. The moans are coming from further down. 
I'd go in, but my sight's no good. You should take this knife. Who knows, you may need it. Can I kill sheep? Can I kill sheep? Oh my. I will have. Can I kill you? Ah, he's just sitting down there. How typical. He's always trying to get out of work. Oh, I can't stab him. I can't stab him. I, I want to stab people. I have an urgent for some stabbing. Oh. Oh my. Do I. Yes! Stab! <laughs> Take that, you sheep, for wasting my time! <laughs> yes! Yes, you will all suffer! This is what you get! I hate you, Polymorph! This is this is my revenge from Hearthstone! Yes! You wanna polymorph something? Polymorph this! Oh, look! I got I got Deathwing out! Yay! Oh you polymorph! No! Ah yes! 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 Ah, oh, glory to me! I think I went a little overboard. Maybe just a little. But what can I say? Oh, read sign. Farm. Alright. Hey guys! What do you have to say? Ah, blood! Uh, it's okay, girl. It's not mine. Oh my goodness. It's. Don't worry. Oh, I'm sorry. <coughs> Robalo. Oh my goodness. Cry. <laughs> Children, please go inside now. Why would you come into the village like this? The sheep commanded me to. Let's see what the chef has to say. How was he like? Huh? Huh? Here's what you get for not sharing your wall bed. I hope you didn't get too close to the animals with that knife. Oh, don't worry. I got as close as I needed to. <laughs> Eat, did you kill the poor sheep for meat? Dad said that we we were doing that next month. Well, little. I don't need to talk to you. I already showed you what I was capable of. I'm not insane. I'm not insane. I'm the sanest person around. No one will argue that point. Will you? No, you won't. I am completely sane. Thanks for the knife. Oh, geez. Well, I did say you need to defend yourself. Did you find out where those moans were coming from? The sheep and <laughs> Okay, well now I'm back. I'm sorry, I just went psychotic there for a moment. It happens. Everyone has a little bit of problems. I mean, it's not like I played Hearthstone this week and it, it, they just kept polymorphing me. What are you? Look at tools. There are some tools le leaning against the wall. It looks like as though they've been used to mark carvings on the wall. Um... I say what was your first guess. <laughs> Let's look at the book. There's a book on top of this pedestal. It's labeled Farmers. There is a list of names inside. Bob Alpha, Jojo, Brandon, Rick Harrison. How eerie. No, no, no. What's eerie is there's a person counting this wall. Hey, are you a rat? Can I stab you? No. Ugh. Oh, my. Oh, my. I do believe. That this knife has driven me insane, but you know, stuff happens. Stuff happens. What we have here? Oh, well, there has been no ghost yet. This is a far cry from what I'm used to. Normally, I'd be running around looking for planks of wood. Uh, we'll talk. Yeah, whatever. You see a man covered in blood? Yes, I don't know. I missed it. I'm sorry. Why do you have blood on your overalls? I hurted myself with my knife. Why do you have a knife? To protect me against monsters. I heard Moses. What have you done? I ran. I was afraid. Mm. You know what? You're covered in blood. You have a knife like me, and I'm covered in blood. We're brothers. I'll let you pass. All right. I'll let you go. I hope he's happy. Okay. What we have here? Wait, wait. Hey, there's a little ghost there. Let's not... Oh, I'm gonna have to go, don't I? Okay, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Ugh, please, help me. I'm in a lot of pain. I came here to end my life. My name is Julia, and I want to see my child and husband in heaven. You don't go to heaven if you commit suicide. I hate to break the news to you. 
My husband was a miner in these caves. He spent, he spent days mining for gold, and then one day he found something. He found a golden nugget. I thought we could retire and be comfortable for the rest of our lives, but he didn't trust me. Oh. <laughs> he buried the golden nugget to spite me, then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about our good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. One day, my son wandered into the cave. He wanted to find his daddy. He wanted to make everything better. Oh no. But he never came out of the cave. I went to look for him, but I couldn't find him. Now it's too late. Now I have nobody. Will you help me? Will you help me in my life? You've done it before. It should be easier now. It should be easier the second time. I did it before? I don't remember doing it the first time. Uh, now, do I end the woman in her misery? Or, but if I end her, I will go to hell. Well, it's better to laugh with the sinners than cry with the saints. Let's do this. Oh, well, I'm sparing her. Sorry, I guess I'm going to heaven. Sorry about that, meant to kill you. That's an awkward thing to say. <laughs> Can you just imagine Murderer coming up? It's like, ah, oh, I missed. Sorry, I meant to kill you. All right, let's see what he says. Oh, I'm free. That's it. No, oh, a farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? It's a bloody Mary. There was a party. You're not. Invited. <laughs> You're not invited. There we go. Why do you have a knife? <coughs> I wanted to get real, real, real good. Ah, uh, well, why do I have a knife? Ah, I know. I butchered the sheep. They whisper. They whisper dark, dark words. I had to stop them. I heard moans. What have you done? Um, your mom. Let's see what happens to you. And that is where the story shall end, at least for now. Well, apparently I spared the lady. <laughs> Hopefully I'll live. It is up to the next player of this game, oh, to choose your fate, just as you chose for the previous player. Enter your first name. Um, sure, we'll just be, enter your email address. I'm gonna block this out. You will be emailed about your fate. Thank you for playing. Press space to submit your details. Have fun and keep playing, y'all.